You have to track performance. You have to track quality control. If you're not willing to do those things, don't get subs. This could be a checklist. It could be a written checklist that you're going to just document from, you know, their performance. So there, the expectations that were set in the original agreement, it comes with a quality control checklist and you have a scorecard for the job. So, hey, did they show up when they said they would show up? Did they clean up the way the agreement said? So you take your whole agreement, those commonly answered questions, all right, like how do we do this? How do we do that? Those are check marks on a printout sheet if, if you need to be, but you're going to track that performance and hold them accountable to the agreement. Hold them accountable and keep score because again, you will start to see the patterns. If you are looking to have somebody that comes in and does the same job every single time that you can count on, you want the least amount of variables and problems. If somebody's like not consistent, that's an indicator that you shouldn't be working with them. 